Hi everyone and uh, welcome back to Tarot for You 444. I'm so excited to have you with me. I'm going to do a really quick spread for each of the star signs now. So I'm going to uh, go through them from Cancer to Scorpio to Capricorn to Virgo, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Taurus, Libra, Pisces, Aquarius and Gemini. So I'm going to start with uh, who's coming towards you in love. Um, and don't forget to check out your uh, longer uh, general love reading for, for this half of the month because all of those are up too. But I thought I'd just do a little quick check in. So Cancer, let's take a look at who is coming towards you or who you're thinking about at the moment in love. We have um, the person you're thinking about is uh, working towards their health at this time. They're having a transformation for the better, starting to feel motivated and energetic. They're starting to take care and look after their health. They are wanting a new beginning with you. Um, if they're not already married to you, they're thinking of perhaps, you know, a proposal to you. And um, this person doesn't want to move slowly anymore. If they've been moving slowly in the past, they're now thinking of, you know, coming in a, a little bit faster than they have done. We could be looking here at either an earth sign, a water sign or... Or a fire sign for you, Cancer. Um, but this person coming towards you is very honest. Someone who has integrity. Someone who's very hardworking. And perhaps um, they have, you know, uh, dark hair with brown or hazel eyes. That's what's coming for you, Cancer. So now we'll go to Scorpio. I'll just shuffle the cards now for Scorpio. Who's coming towards you in love? Okay. <clears throat> wow. I'm I'm kind of getting this feeling that, you know, whoever you're dealing with at the moment, moment Scorpio, has had some stuff going on. You know, they've been overthinking a little bit and taking time to recover. Um, <clears throat> wow. I'm getting, you know, my throat shark was playing up with this person because... They, um, what are they, what's going on here? They feel like powerless in their situation. There's something in their situation that makes, me, that makes them feel powerless. They're hoping that, that you'll move towards them um, and have a new beginning with them. They are perhaps at a distance from you, Scorpio, and... Um, you know, the, the energy that's coming through of this person, although they've had a, a difficult time, you know, this person is very caring. This is this is someone who, you know, is uh, or has been, uh, you know, someone from your past perhaps or someone who you have a very deep spiritual connection with. So Scorpio, that's beautiful. They may just need a little bit of help at this time. Capricorn, let's see who's coming towards you in love. Okay, wow. <laughs> Capricorn, you're a bit lucky. We've got, wow, we've got this beautiful soulmate, perhaps even twin flame energy here. Um, someone who you, who wants to have a family with you. Someone who who is thinking about happy and, you know, happy times, family celebrations, healthy children. They absolutely love you with all of their heart. They have a love and understanding of you. They feel that you belong together. They've had a recent transformation um, and they're trying to take a leap of faith with you and they're all about being in their heart chakra with you. They they need to believe in, in themselves a little bit more um, so that they can take a leap of faith towards you. Uh, they need to take a little bit of a risk now 
that's a nice one capricorn okay virgo virgo what's happening for you let's see who's coming towards virgo virgo i feel like there could have been a third party situation uh with you perhaps this person you're inquiring about you know it has an, another significant other or perhaps you do uh, they have been um <clears throat> Wow, wanting to communicate with you, perhaps even looking at your social media. Um, they are working hard towards a new job or something, you know, um, something to help them make money. So you'll know them uh, because you're probably already talking to them on social media. They are a high achiever. Uh, they enjoy their work. They're also very, very passionate this could be someone with brown hair or blue or hazel eyes. They have sexual passion for you. They've perhaps done a lot of traveling. They're very honorable and very kind to others, despite, um, you know, perhaps this third party situation being in the way. The third party situation may not be another person. It could be a place or a, or a thing that's coming in the way of the connection, like you could live at a distance from one another or perhaps be from different cultures. Um, they are athletic to some degree and they are very mature. They are also very generous and very smart in business. They also want to make love to you. <laughs> Go Virgo. Okay, Aries. Wow. Aries, yours just flipped out there. Who is coming towards Aries? We've got someone who's been a little bit stressed. Someone who has... Um, had you know their kind they've been kind to others and people are taking advantage of them which could be affecting their health this person has a lot of love for you Aries they are very articulate loving and sensuous highly intelligent very generous and sociable so they like being around lots of people uh, they are loyal and very responsible and warm-hearted they think that you are the sun, the warmth. There's been a little bit of a difficulty in, in this person coming towards you uh, because something regarding their money uh, and security and stability is, is stopping this. Um, again, someone is also taking advantage of their kindness um, and maybe even taking con you know, control over them in some way. So, um, yeah, they're kind of having to stand up for themselves at this time, Aries, the person coming towards you. Alrighty, Leo, we're up to you now. Let's see what's going on for Leo. Leo in love. Who's coming towards Leo in love? The cards want to be shuffled just that little bit more for you, Leo. So this must be someone important. Let me see. Here we go. Okay, we've got dogs barking, so they must be really important. They're trying to get a message through to you at this time. You may be hearing from this person. This is a spiritual connection, um, someone who very much cares about you. Um, for a very small few of you, someone in spirit is trying to connect with you at this time. So watch out for signs and synchronicities around, around your home um, and or workplace. Okay, so this person coming towards you is slightly exhausted, needs to replenish themselves, feels a little bit overwhelmed. They have had some uh, heartache or betrayal by other people and this has caused them some overthinking and anxiety. They're working now towards their security and their material stability and financial gain. It looks like their financial issues that they had will soon be overcome. So they're kind of a bit savvy in terms of their work, Leo. All right, Sagittarius, who is coming towards you in love? Let's have a look. Okay. This person is, has been a little bit sick. Um... What's happened is that they've had some, you know, some mental conflict recently. They've been worrying. They've been a little bit um, 
you know, overthinking, perhaps a little bit of anxiety. Um, and this caused them to uh, have some sleepless nights and they could have even had a loss of a relationship recently. You know, that doesn't necessarily mean another person, another lover. This could be someone, you know, in their family or someone, um, you know, um, just, you know, a friend or something. Um, okay, so the message here is that, you know, sometimes this person unfortunately seems to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. They you know they're around other people who are drama dramatic you know drama type people which makes this person feel trapped at not having control over the situation but this is in the past energy so it looks like they're coming out of this energy now um and they're kind of in healing mode all right taurus let's go to you now and see what's going on for taurus Taurus in love who who is coming towards you or your significant person what is going on with them let's see okay Taurus someone here loves you with all of their heart uh, there is a a love and understanding between you and this other person there's this feeling of belonging together if they haven't come in yet um, it's because um, they could perhaps have some celebrations going on with family or friends. Um, I also am feeling uh, that they are wanting to travel towards you, Taurus, wanting to move towards you, wanting to help you solve your problems, moving into the right direction. They're very, very passionate about you. Uh, perhaps they've already asked you for your hand in marriage perhaps they're going to um, you know this person is coming through with the love uh, and also with the um, passion so you know this is fire fire and water together which is kind of a really beautiful mix because you know you've got all that emotion there and you've got this uh, lovely um, feeling of you know of want for you okay so this could be someone with a fair to ruby complexion um and you know they could be a little bit hasty in their personality so they just kind of know what they want and they know they want you taurus this is really cute uh <laughs> actually cute's the wrong word uh kind of sexy i would say okay libra let's have a look at you Libra, we have someone here who uh, you could already be with, as in you could already be in a relationship with this person. There has been a little bit of burden uh, for this person of late. Um, you know, they shouldn't be taking on all these burdens. This other person shouldn't be because it can be quite stressful. They really love you a lot. Um, they are loving and sensuous, highly intelligent um, very responsible and loyal they have a warm heart and they also uh, you know have this high achievement um, you know they can celebrate in their work they're very very savvy with their you know uh, their skills to make money um, so they kind of you know you know we're getting this business person this kind of businessy sense but also loving so we you know we could be dealing with a fire sign a water sign uh, or an earth sign here for you Libra let's go to Pisces now and see what's going on with Pisces Pisces who is coming towards you in love at this time okay Pisces this is someone who might be struggling with money a little bit having an issue with their material stability or security um, there is a need for them to uh, have some financial gain. I'm just doing a reading at this time. And with the Nine of Wands here, we can see that um, we, we have someone who, who doesn't quite believe in themselves or who wants to believe in themselves, but they've had, you know, something, a situation 
come over um, or a shock of some kind in fact and you know I just got interrupted during the reading just then and so it's you know that's a synchronicity for you Pisces um, you know someone coming in um, and you know giving them a bit of a shock or a, um, I don't know an enlightening thing and so they had to take some time out to get over this so I'm not quite sure what's going on here, but it does also say on the cards that this shock that they had could be a blessing in disguise. So that's really good news for you, Pisces. Aquarius, let's see what's going on with you. Aquarius, who is coming towards you in love? Someone could have lost their strength recently. You know, they could have felt a little bit unwell Um in the recent past but now they're moving into the right direction and they're they're feeling this new beginning energy you know they're they're really wanting to come towards you and if they're at a distance from you um, that's what they want to do so these restrictions or this run of bad luck that's happened for this person you know the reason why they lost their strength in the first place is really only a trapped a trapped energy of them not knowing how to break free from a feeling that they've you know placed themselves in mentally okay so you know they've had a lot of passion for you for a very long time Aquarius you know they are generous they are fan a fantastic advisor this is someone who is mature perhaps they enjoy sports um, they are honorable to people around them and they are also very very kind this could be someone who's done a lot of traveling and they are really highly attracted to you in a sexual way. So they want to come in and, you know, offer more than just love. So Gemini, let's take a look at what's going on for you in love. I see that there is someone in spirit trying to connect with you, Gemini. This is an aside to, uh, you know, this, this uh, love scenario. But there's a male spirit guide here. A wise and capable male soul that could have been in your life who is trying to get your attention and guide you into the right direction okay so that's a little side message for some some of you who are listening today okay so we have this energy now of the person coming towards you you know has been working on their money has been working on their plans of abundance has been trying to temper themselves when they became overwhelmed um, you know, and drained from a work situation. They could have um, also recently signed a contract of some kind or they want to sign a contract of marriage um, with you. There is also a legal decision here that could go their way if they're having legal uh, troubles. And yeah, that's what I have for you today for all the star signs. So thank you for joining me here at Tarot for You 444. If you'd like a personal reading, don't forget my, my details are in the description box below. And I will see you real soon. Bye everyone. Bye.